Okay, so this is the, uh, the lift shuttle. And as you can see, it's all windows except for the, the doorway, or door which I'm standing in here. Uh, I've set up a lot of buttons here so I could go in and see Sam and be able to configure it and everything. Not really happy with the layout. And uh, typically I had, before I built this today, I put just one button in here. And so you could come inside and you hit the one button and it goes to the next location. And that was all there was. But I wanted to be able to see this stuff and, and program it. So I've got uh, the configuration screen up here and I've, I've got a whole bunch of connectors that are out there. But I really only want this shuttle to be able to go between the first two. So I'm going to go ahead and add this, uh, this second one here. Come back here. And then we'll go over to the, the navigation. So this would typically be what I would suggest that you'd have, especially for a public shuttle. This would be what I'd have for the screen. People could get in there and then there'd be an up and down perhaps, or just a, a down, you know, a, a selector and uh, to be able to move through to the next ones. And we want to go to this next one. So we do that and then uh, we, we wouldn't have this select button. We just have the run button, which is what this one is. So I'm going to uh, take the shuttle, or well, I didn't take it, send it. <laughs> I'm standing on the, the edge of the doorway here, the, the closed door. And so it's going to go over to the other location, which is a, a little flat base that I've got over there. And uh, it's going to head over and get into that connector that you can see. So I'm going to go inside here. And this is the this is a big drilling rig base that that I've got that uh, does an infinite drill I've been working on. So okay, it's now over at the other location, and so I've got a, a single call shuttle button here, and you can see up uh, that right here in the center is that uh, Sam RC LCD. And this will work in, in a server or on a PC. This is just running on my PC, so I'm not on the server. But this does work because it's with the remote. If you use the LCD, they work. So that shuttle's sitting over there. And I'm just going to hit the call shuttle button, the single one button. And it says, OK, it sent the message to that uh, LCD there. And the shuttle is headed back this way. So you can go to any location and set it up like this and then you'd have a, a button any kind of a button the big red button or this this one and i like this because you can put the call shuttle put some text up there and the shuttle is on its way back to where you are so works real good i've got the automatic closing doors thing so i have to keep opening them here um, and it, if you notice the door is on the shuttle is closed right now and then when it comes up and locks, it will open. So I, that's what I built in my shuttle. And it, I need to build that, you know, to finish this, I'd want to open the door here at the base properly and so on and so forth. But I just wanted to give you a quick video to show you that this does work. And uh, if I go over to the other base here, and, uh, Come down here. I've got just a big red button over here. And I don't have a door on this side. It's just really a just a test base. So you can see that big drilling rig and it's a big like an office building looking thing. It's pretty slick. I really like it. Yeah. Having problems with the drills, but we'll get there. Uh, so the shuttle is now coming over here. So if you had had to respawn or whatever, like you were saying, your trouble was, then it'll do that. But I'll, I'll get a real official video put together and uh, get the instructions on how all this is set up and everything. Um, it's pretty easy, but I, I like my little lift. 
it's got a, a storage unit in it, uh, uh, a small or medium container, I guess it is. And then you can put up to six people in here, or you can even sit if it's a long trip. So I always like this little ship. Um, anyway, that's the that's what's happening.